Hello friends, welcome to my channel Cuts of Life. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to make puff pastry. And what I'm preparing today is egg puffs. And uh, what I'm using for the egg puffs is uh, this product, which is newly launched in the Goan market and which is very easily available on my store in Chinchini, the cake stand. For all my Goan lovers uh, who love to make puff pastry, do visit my store. And this is this product is available on my store. So it's uh, Rennie's goodies and it says just thaw, roll, stuff and bake and uh, which is already book folded along with the fats and uh, which will give you multiple layers once baked and it also has all the steps how to make the puff, uh, the baking temperatures, the timings, everything is mentioned and not to worry even the first timers can do so. So let's uh, get started, let me keep this aside and let me show you what are the rest of the ingredients. Uh, this is the flour that I am using, uh, regular refined flour uh, for dusting of the pastry and uh, this is the egg wash which I will use for the brushing of the pastry before baking. And this is the egg stuffing what I have made over here. I have just boiled eggs and sauteed onions, tomatoes, chilies with uh, garam masala, turmeric and ginger garlic paste. I have not added anything else. Uh, that's what that what I prepared over here and you can use chicken you can use seafood you can use vegetable just vegetables if you would like to make it a vegetarian puff so let's get started so you go, just got to open up this uh, packet and uh, take out the puff pastry and there is a piece of ingredients if you can see over here uh, which will give you exact steps on how to make the puff pastry even the baking temperatures are mentioned so let me keep this uh, paper aside and uh, just pull out the dough the dough comes frozen and uh, you just got to thaw it overnight in the refrigerator and then half an hour for outside to make it thaw and very easy to roll up so let's uh, so this is the final dough and uh, if you can see the layers over here and uh, which will give me like perfect uh, layers after baking the final product so as you are going to do this uh, let me switch on my oven to get it preheated So oven is getting preheated and let's uh, quickly sheet this uh, dough up uh, so that we can make our puffs uh, very fast and very easily. So I'm gonna cut this dough. And I made it into two halves. I'm gonna use half of this dough and half I'm gonna wrap up. This whole dough will give you around 25 to 26 pieces of the puffs if you make it uh, like a quarter inch uh, thickness of the pastry sheet. So let's uh, quickly roll this pastry up and make it into a flat sheet of pastry. So you apply equal pressure to the whole pastry. Do not uh, overpower yourself and uh, do not give additional force so you give equal force to all the sides and you keep on making it into a flat sheet So you just uh, clean the outer surface of the so you just take off the additional flour just to clean up the surface 
and to make your work more easy so uh, this will be the exact size of uh, half of a pastry dough and uh, what we'll do is now we'll cut it into pieces so you can cut it like this either you can use a pizza roller or you can use a knife doesn't matter end of the day what you have to do is you have to cut so you just cut it like this and uh, that's about it you got nine over here and uh, what we'll do now is we'll add in the filling so I'm gonna use one piece of egg along with uh, some of the stuffing I'm gonna show you two different shapes of the puffs. You can make whatever shape you want. Uh, either you can make a triangle or you can make a, like a square or like a rectangle, doesn't matter. So the oven is all heated up. the temperature is all set and the puffs are ready to go in to the oven so here you go this is the amount of filling you got to add so you apply egg wash along one side the puff just to fold in and to make a triangle you apply egg wash on two sides like an L Let's start uh, folding up the puffs and you gently press the edges where you have applied the egg wash and you use a fork and press the edges so that uh, once baked it does not uh, open up. So here you go, one of them is ready and to go on to the next one, you do the same way. So you just press the edges and then you press it with the fork. So to just seal the edges and a mixture shouldn't come out of the puff. So let's do a triangle now and you just fold up two corners and then you seal up all the edges. So even this can be a shape. And then you do the same method. You just seal up all the edges. that's another shape what you can do and then you press up all the edges so that's uh, one of a shape and this one again into a square I mean a, a rectangle so as the puffs are done next what you do is uh, you take a grease tray a tray that I have just brushed with the fat and uh, arrange the puffs on to the tray. So you 
arrange it nicely and evenly. And uh, once this is done, you brush it with the egg. The egg uh, that has been just beaten up and uh, you brush the pastry or the puff along on the whole side. So you brush it nicely to get nice even golden color. So after brushing, your oven is all heated up and uh, you put it inside the oven quickly and the temperature is all set to 200 degrees centigrade for around 10 minutes and then we'll reduce the temperature to 180 degrees centigrade. So let's wait and uh, let's see what is the final outcome of this puff pastry. As you can see it is all done, you can see a nice golden color. What we'll do is we'll switch off the oven, open up uh, the oven door and uh, wow the smell is awesome. I mean it, it is giving a beautiful aroma. You can see it's uh, nice and golden and put it up over here, close the oven door. And uh, these are my egg puffs. can see and uh, the greasing of the tray is very important or else the puffs will all break up so let's uh, quickly take it into a plate the different shapes you can if you can see the half moon it has uh, given wonderful layers and it's it looks really beautiful so I'm just arranging it, it into the tree and here you go so these are the egg puffs so here you go guys and these are the egg puffs specially baked with uh, Rennie's goodies and that's the puff pastry which is available at my store the cake stand chinchini and uh, do visit my store for this and we have a lot of products too and uh, as always I'm a chef and I've got to do the tasting so let me taste one of this and uh, let me show you the layering and the multi layers that uh, this product is giving up so let me take the smallest one and I'll do the tasting Wow, it's quite light and very fluffy and my mixture or my stuffing gives it a good combination. So guys do try, let me know in the comment section and do post your pictures too and do visit my store too for this product and thanks for watching and do subscribe to my channel. Thank you once again.